Good morning, people. We are on our way to Jeffrey's Bay. I've got MJ with me this morning. <laughs> Lee always helps me. Let me just open. Lee, how do you open this here? Mm -hmm. Ooh. Did I, cool? oh. <laughs> I never check my way. I don't even know how to open my bonnet. I don't even know how to open my bonnet for the woman to check my way in my water. Anyway, guys, we're on our way to Jeffrey's Bay and we stopped at my favorite petrol port. I could have filled up in Port Elizabeth, I didn't. But I didn't realize that this is a shell garage. I do not really like filling up with shell. I normally do Celtics. And then we go in because they've got a wool, no, they've got a Spar Express. It used to be a wool with a Spar Express. A lovely, a lovely baby. Oh, the atmosphere inside is gorgeous. And there's a steers and there's a KFC. Okay, so um, then we are going to go in and do that. So enjoy the ride. I on purpose didn't put the camera on from PE to here because you've seen this when we go to crossways and whatever, you've seen this a lot. We will put the camera on from here on. Enjoy the ride. Just look at this people, this is absolutely nice. It's a real fire. Oh, you can feel the heat from here. This is wonderful. Just look at the view as well. Huh? Now it's like a, a whale tail and it's made out of scrap metal. These poor people are going to wait for us and <laughs> this time is just becoming a very long day. <laughs> a very long drawn out day. I don't know what happened. People, I was up at 6 o'clock this morning and I'm still, we are still not in Jeffrey's <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's lots. Fred will never ever invite us out again. <laughs> we're, going to, we're going to land there at lunchtime. I just hope that the, the girls, the, the ladies, I just hope that the ladies um, will wait for us. You know what, MJ? If I now make a mistake talking, yeah. I can't really edit it out because then they. they out on a part of the journey. So I must be careful that I speak correctly. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. I can edit it out, but then there's a gap in the journey. Yeah. So if you if you drive somewhere or whatever you are recording is important. You That's must true. yes, otherwise um, there's a gap. Ha, ha, ha. 
with a handsaw. A handsaw and. Uh, but you know how to work ropes, which is really nice. Yeah. Some of the, uh, the black helpers. for yourself. And you can stand at a stop and go for up to half an hour easily. But you must, Almost. there's no other way that they can work on the roads and prepare, oh he's going to go for a wee. <laughs> but where else must you go? He's weeing on camera. Why must men always look around when they wee? Everybody knows that he's taking a, a, a leak there. But now he looks left and he looks right. You're giving the, yourself away, guide. I'm going to just edge a little bit forward. <laughs> okay, now he's looking down at, at his equipment. <laughs> he was looking, he was looking, yeah. He was looking left, then he's looking right. Whew. Shame his bladder was full. Surely he can't be weeing still. Okay, there he's done. Okay. That's also what happens in South Africa, people. I actually must do it myself sometimes. But I go a little bit deeper into the bush. <laughs> I make sure that nobody can see me. Also, not the people that sit in the trucks because the truck driver, like the truck you behind, they hide. 
And you must play that you know you don't get bitten by a snake while you are sitting. But you do get these cups that women can also have the standing experience. <laughs> Marking the trees <laughs> with our pheromones. And then now these cars are coming. So after they have now walked through, then they are going to open up for us to go. So in the front, there is only one lane. Oh, look at you. Okay, you are so clever. You know, these young guys, they are just. Um, they technically just that's for the fun. I could have just used this one. No, you could have. That's actually the one for this. Yeah. This is the gimbal one that you've used now. Yeah, this is the table mic. Hi. Table mic. Okay. Unbelievable. Okay. Yeah. Now I've learned something as I'm trying out this new mic, people. I had to buy a big contraption to actually get this mic because the other little mics that I have gives me terrible distortion and um, then I um, and I don't have the other phone on now then I must actually use the sound from the other phone and put it over the video of the other phone and that's a lot of work because then I must make sure that the lips are in sync because I'm, I'm bringing a complete total soundtrack over and um, so I hope that this mic is going to be a uh, better especially driving because what I found was that the, the the other little mics was picking up the vibration the, the phone yeah the phone was picking up the vibration on the windscreen and then also it, it was just distorted I could, and I, I just couldn't listen to it uh, but what when I when when I get home and I start editing, there's nothing I can do. Then I either I either post it like that, or I have now wasted money and a whole day on a vlog trip. Especially if we go now, like today, yeah. on a vlog trip, and um, it's going to be very nice if we, you hold that as well while we are doing this. Mm. It's going to be very nice. And I can put it on you. <laughs> you can, yeah. Because the phone actually go in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And your mic goes there. Yeah. Yeah. Now that I know. <laughs> and then your light goes there if yeah. you use the light, but we're not going to use the light. And then the actually? little I did bring batteries, but I you must just have a look. There's a little remote. Mm -hmm. But I think the remote also needs a little battery. And I don't know. Ah, look at that. <laughs> I will also have that problem. Oh, yeah. Fortunately, you know. Yeah. Uh, but fortunately, I haven't videoed myself. I've got lipstick all over my teeth, people. Mm. But at least Marius knows me well enough to tell me. I hate it when um, you have a piece of food or spinach or lettuce <laughs> or whatever <laughs> or parsley stuck between your teeth and you, you know, and I, I laugh a lot with my mouth open and then everybody will look at that nobody will tell you you know mm. just take it out of your teeth <coughs> they will not, rather let you go home and look at a video that you can't do over and feel so embarrassed that you must take it out yeah uh, I, I appreciate it when people tell me listen you have something stuck or that you've got a booger in your nose because that also happens mm -hmm. you know just take it out don't let everybody stare at it for a whole day or that you've got sleep in your eyes that's another thing you know and then if you if you wear makeup and you've got sleep in your eyes then the the it clog the mascara and the eyeshadow and the stuff clog with the sleep and then you um <laughs> now Morris is also checking his eyes <laughs> um clock so just kind of just tell somebody you know you okay here we go okay this is how a stop and go works people you know, just close your window otherwise we get you know, that's the one thing if you vlog you must you've got to put and I love driving with my windows open I know you and your dad as well on the <laughs> long road especially because your father could fall asleep so easily yeah Yesterday. But me too. He came, yeah, no, you. I always said to you, stay awake to keep your dad awake. But, but that never was. <laughs> I 
no, you just not even out of I know, I know. Every time I'm standing in a video or a photo, I look at Marius. Marius is fast asleep. Then you would sometimes stop next to the road and run a little bit <laughs> up and down just to wake up, remember? <laughs> I woke up the one night my dad wasn't in a button. Where's the ghost boss? I don't know. I don't know. What are you doing now? This is now jogging. Just, but the board says wild animals. <laughs> yeah. oh, I remember it so well. to places where I've never thought I've gone that you would go to so, like where? Uh, Apele, Louis Trichard uh, yeah, oh with your father yeah. with the machines yes I know you still yeah. you yeah, still have blocked the whole uh, one to Durban that mm -hmm. whole trip and the um, the, the B, B that you stayed in and whatever yeah, look at the stop and go people yeah this is how it works but at least they are working on our roads. Uh -huh. This is a smooth ride because our roads are in a terrible, terrible state. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> this will now normally be oncoming traffic. Yeah. If um, they're not working on the roads. There's actually three lanes and then we're coming to here at the top. Yeah. Sure, it's a long one. It's a long strip of a, a stop and go. Long strip. So we're going to hit it coming back as well. Yep. Ooh. Yeah, that's tar stones. Yeah, I know. Okay, that's a pity. They should actually just tar it completely. Now they're leaving patches. Yeah. Why? So now every time when you're gonna go and yeah, buy, it's gonna go. Yeah. Shroom, shroom. I mean, that was now absolutely nuts. They are busy. Why don't they just do everything? What is that little bit going to save them in tar? This road's going to sound like when you come into Durban. They, but they will never have done that in the Western Cape. Never. The guy's got a lot of green, um, greenhouses now. It makes no sense. You are busy just do the, the whole... Oh, okay. So this is the end of it, isn't Only it? in South Africa. Yeah, they've now gone it's over the side. Very nice, look at this. Yeah. Beautiful. But why only now? Is this also a stop and go? I think it is. I think this is popular. Now they work on that side, not. No, no. Well, they must do it We're sometime. going through like this now. There's then, Jeffries. Yeah. You really? Okay, so what's the time? What's the time? Okay, you saw? Okay, at least it's morning still. <laughs> I must now phone um, Fred as we come into Jeffries because then he's going uh, to get us there. Did you hear about the um, the surfing competition that gone wrong? No. Yeah, from Jeffries. No. Um, yeah, was Look at the people. Can I just sorry? Look at now how they're standing. They're now waiting for us to come through. It's a long stop and go. And now look at this idiot. Sorry, but that is an idiot. The Bible say you're not allowed to call anybody an idiot, but that is an idiot. Well, where is he going to? He can't cut in, in into... Oh, my soul. Even if he goes to the front of that lane, there's nowhere that he can cut into. He now thought it's like big traffic that if he now does that, then he can. somebody's going to give him a gap in the front and he's going to be able to cut in. Oh, my soul driving skills in South Africa it's like nobody we've got circles roundabouts everywhere and I must use my asthma pump I'm very short of breath when we get out there it's like the roundabouts nobody knows how to use it everybody thinks it's a four-way stop Money that I 
has been stolen that should have been used on maintenance of our roads because I can assure you that a lot of maintenance money for the roads have landed in some of the government officials pockets and now we must leave certain areas like that um, otherwise they can't finish the job but they're not finished yeah no <laughs> well let's see we will must see we will see there, there definitely there's no tar machines coming back in look at what look at what it looks like oh, okay this is i find that upsetting maybe it's my perfectionistic brain that can't handle patchwork like this maybe it's that <laughs> that is upsetting me no end huh? it's just terrible it almost looks like tetris blocks oh, it makes no sense <laughs> it's just the logic behind it that makes no sense to me really it makes no sense stay in your lane where does he want to go to <sighs> and i'm already crawling at 80 again what is my problem what is this river hot to us uh yes okay hot to us <laughs> my american and overseas people always um make Gentles. draw my attention to the fact that we use a lot of harsh <laughs> in, yeah. in afrikaans so in english it would be gam to us but yeah. it's actually not it's actually gam to us i don't think there's something like a gam to us <laughs> it is a gam to us that's what it is <laughs> and it's full and it's nice and blue It's low tide. Low tide. Yeah. I said salt water comes in. Yeah. Okay. How far does the salt water push in here? Uh, you've got 90% uh, pure water on the top, and then about 90% salt water on the bottom. But only it can only be like that for a few kilometers, yeah. close to the sea. Uh, more, more in it should be fresh water only. Yeah. Right. But still, the sharks swim from the mouth up. Oh, that I know. I heard that. I wanted to say something, and then I thought, no. I wanted to say something. <laughs> We can go. It's your uh, normally your tiger sharks, um, uh, some mizis. Uh, Which one attack? No, that actually swim upstream to go from salt water to fresh water and breed. So you oh. So to spawn. To so spawn, to spawn yeah. So if if a dog swims, I must go in there. Must uh, I go in there? Jeffries, yeah. Must I? It's a Jeffries, yeah. No man. No. Huh? Come to us, river mouth. No, it's still further oh, down. No. But the, the Jeffries did. He did say Jeffries. But I think Jeffries. He did say Jeffries. <laughs> Where's Jeffries born? This is the back road to the... I think so. No, oh, this is the back road. <laughs> okay, shop. okay, and then you go past the... That is Jeffries. Did I not go past it? You go down there again. <laughs> Just be 
surfing competitions in our past. Okay. As I was saying about the um, surfing competition, yeah. um, a very well-known Australian surfer um, got attacked by a great mob. Wait.
with the Nissan Champ. If my dad didn't lay on his router, he would have taken out this pole. <gasps> no. The actual 3000, 2000, and 1000 would have taken out. He fell asleep. No. In the back was his young, uh, his son, yeah. and his wife, and his brother and um, him was in the front. Oh, it is before the bridge. Yeah. <laughs> Just at the wrong bridge. <laughs> oh, that one would have taken us way yeah. longer. Yeah.
are we in maps? You just went out of maps. <laughs> I just went out of maps. Maps. King's College. Oh, there it is. Jeffrey's Bay. Jeffrey's. No, not Jeffrey's. Jeffrey's. Jeffrey. Jeffrey's. Bay. Search. Ah, my world auto. Ah, in it, though. That would have helped. Now I must do it again. Then, yeah. Come on, I'll try again. Maps. Then. Jeffrey's. Okay, where she must not talk to us? Please talk to me. <coughs> where? She's going to tell us. You, right. you sh shut her up now, now. Okay, we're going to go around the circle again. Around the circle that again. Circle, yeah. Okay, I must going go back down to that the circle. Okay, now I must get back to the circle. Here's another circle. Which circle? That one there. I remember last time I was completely confused with all these circles. I was here with Omar and Irina. In 50 meters, at the roundabout, take the fourth exit. Okay, that's that one. Yeah. In 200 meters, at the roundabout, take the third exit. And then it's going down. Then we're going down there with the truck. Yeah. <laughs> out of Jeffries to go to St. Francis. My mother was besides herself furious. <laughs> besides herself. In 600 meters, at the roundabout, take the second exit. Wait now, is there another roundabout coming up? Yes, I don't know. That's it. Got more roundabouts here than they've got in our... Six minutes. Nick of the woods. Yeah, we'll 
people to live in this area. In Jeffries? Yeah. Are you serious? Why? No, the streets are here like, um, it's like driving around in Cape Town. I thought you would like to be so close to the beach. Not Jeffries. Okay, that's very interesting. No, I need what? flat waters, not rough oh. waters. <laughs> Yeah, the waves can get huge yeah. huge. Oh, they were talking mm. last year, December, there was um, not, between 9 to 10 meters swells here. You know, I used to, so. in my younger days, I couldn't keep out of the, mm. out of the sea. But I'm telling you, temperatures have changed yeah. and sharks have made appearances where they never used to be. You will not get me into the sea. locations first <clears throat> and when there's trouble brewing then the trouble is with the roads then they stop all economic activity because in 400 meters your destination will be on the right oh goodness then they stop all economic activity because you cannot actually get into the cities and the towns because you must go through the locations first and then they are throwing rocks and bricks and burning tires and yeah just havoc creating havoc okay i always say i shouldn't discuss controversial topics on my channel and here i am Let's go. 
five trees on your possession. That is only for personal use, not for selling or for giving a friend for a birthday party. Okay. But so, in America they pull the people off. I yeah. watched the videos where, the, where those drivers then refuse to get out of the car. I don't know how the law works there, but one, if they stay in the property, the, the vehicle is your property. Yeah. Um, but I watch videos and to me it seems like there is still a little bit of an issue as far as Daha is concerned. And um, and that the police uses the loopholes to make it difficult for some people, mm -hmm. which I, I don't approve of. Where are we? Is it so close to the... It's the 
little English bullies. Ooh. There was one. Well, there's two. They're out. Three. Is it safe for them to run like this? Do they know where they're going? Now they're getting separated. Because that one is not in that one. That's how dogs get lost. differently otherwise I'm going to <laughs> okay I must park behind you 